Jane Callahan is the owner of Pie Oh My, a bakery which recently debuted a food truck. Pie Oh My serves savory pies and other sweet treats, and uh, here to tell us all about it is Jane Callahan. Welcome, Jane. Hi, Sarah. The founder and owner of Pie Oh My. Mm -hmm. So take us back. We know it's been a couple years of right. um, uh, immediate success in Maplewood, but you started prior to right. that. So I grew up baking pies. My mom taught me how to make pies. I grew up on a farm in Minnesota. So she really taught me how to do it, and I've um, really done that and enjoyed doing that my whole life and had a professional life doing um, government work and um, nonprofit work. Mm -hmm. And they made a conscious decision to leave that office life and open the business and pursue something that was really uh, hands-on. Profession. And so how has that transition been? Because I know I, we meet a lot of people right here on our set who make that a big career transition at some point from something similar, a similar story, from mm -hmm. a regular job to mm -hmm. a passion. Mm -hmm. And it's sometimes harder than it seems like it would be. Well, you know, I, I decided to approach it incrementally. And for me, that was um, really the best, the best way to do it. So I, I uh, rented commercial kitchen space initially mm -hmm. and um, took on some, you know a few wholesale customers and I did a farmers market and then I did direct delivery to customers homes that way I didn't have the um, commitment of a storefront and for me that was great I learned a lot in that process and then I think more importantly assessed whether there was demand for my product and then I was able to tweak it and so that was about a two-year stretch where I was year and a half, two years when I was doing that. Yeah, and so what about market research for the pie world? I mean, you know, we have a lot of cupcake businesses opening right. up and that kind of thing. Where did you, obviously you grew up making pies, you love pies yourself, but market did you? Market research, well, you know, that's pretty expensive. And I, the, my business says I'm a, I'm a pretty frugal person, so I didn't, you know, have any market research per se. But, but I think that- you have a sense that it would well, be. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. You know, I think the uh, trend towards things that are made from scratch and the small batch approach really resonates with people and then in the farmers market environment you know and and the uh, home delivery people love the idea of knowing that it's a real person that made mm -hmm. what they're eating and you know we use fresh fruit and we make everything from scratch but you're talking about the um, uh, market research on the the after like a, a month or so of opening the business when I was renting space, I opened the uh, New York Times on my birthday, and uh, there was this big article, and it, it was uh, Pies of the New Cupcake. So I thought, well, that's just, you know, serendipitous. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is good. So good. So, so there's a trend in the baking world to move towards pies. I and, think so. Yeah. I think so. I mean, I love cupcakes, too. Don't get me wrong. But, yeah, um, yeah I think that people are excited about something something new and, and different. And you're sticking just to pies though. Right. We you do have just to, pies. Look at the name of your business. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. We do just pies. And really for the first um, year or so in the store, we did just dessert pies, but beginning in uh, in January we expanded to do savory pies as well. So what kind of savory pies do you have? So in the store we do um, ready to bake chicken pot pies. So mm -hmm. uh, folks can come in and uh, take it home and keep it in their freezer and then bake it at their convenience in their homes. But on the food truck, we do um, other kinds of savories and we're, you know, we're experimenting all the time with uh, different, different kinds of savories that feature you know, different kinds of ethnic cuisines. Okay, interesting. So yeah. in the food truck, do you actually bake on the truck? Oh God, no. It's <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we bake everything in the store. Mm and uh, it's all prepared and then we take it into the truck. We do have a warming oven for the savory items, but I mean, don't get me wrong, the truck is all very much up to code and mm. it has, has all the equipment, but it doesn't have an oven. And because we don't fry, any of our products, it's, there's not a fryer or a grill or anything like that. Okay, good. All right, so we're going to take a quick break right now, Jane. When we come back, we're going to talk more about the, the hurdles and some of the rewards of being an entrepreneur here in okay. St. Louis, and then we're going to get some of the details on that food truck, some okay. more details. So we need to take a quick break, but stay tuned. We'll be back with Jane Callahan, owner of Pie oh My, right after this.